As many of you know, the restoration of Saints Row is a tremendous success, but that was just the beginning of what Old Tor has in mind for Stillwater. This is Shivington. Once a pristine set of tenement homes, this neighborhood has devolved into a dangerous ghetto filled with undesirables such as these. Now, I'm sure a lot of you are wondering, ugly buildings, unwashed masses, what the hell is Old Tor thinking? My friends, we are thinking about the future. Picture this, glass towers, clean streets, and no one below the poverty line trying to wash your car. Impossible? For a lesser company, maybe. Now, I'm not here to make idle promises or vague predictions. No offense to all of you politicians out there. No, I'm here to show you how we're going to do it. Now, obviously, before we can remodel Shivington, we need to own the land. So how do we do that? By directing the gangs towards Sunnyvale. Not only are we lowering the number of our detractors, we are lowering the property value as well, which means when we buy the land, the savings get passed on to you, the stockholders. The gangs cripple each other. We direct funds to the Stillwater Police Department. They increase police presence, and pretty soon, all those nasty little gangbangers are gone. Crime stops, property value goes up, and now your population looks like this. This could be going better. Bad time, Gat. Yeah? Well, I got a couple APZs trying to run my ass down. Listen, if they're coming for us, you can bet your ass they're gonna be pissed Johnny too. You gotta go check on Shit, I'm on it.
You can't hide from Altar! <laughs> Got some amazing timing. Altor a lot more when they just made clothes. What you do to piss these guys off? Fuck if I know. Yo, I signed on for killing gangbangers, not fighting some SWAT team from hell. Don't worry about it, Pierce. We'll take care of it. The fuck you mean don't worry about it? These guys are packing space aid shit. Hey, Shundi, you date anyone who worked at a place called the Pyramid? No. For real? All right. You two find out whatever you can about this place. I want to take these assholes apart. Hey, thanks for meeting me. I appreciate it. You kidding me? I'm not passing up a chance to hurt Altor. What you got for me? I know about some things Altor wants to keep buried. Honey, I got shit to do. I don't have time for poetics. Hey, who's being poetic? I'm talking about bodies. Well, why didn't you say so? Did you find the first body yet? It's been like 30 seconds. What's the rush? Well, I'd like you to find the damn things before a Masako team comes after me. How do you know about these bodies? Doesn't matter. Seeing as I'm about to get shot trying to get them, hell yeah. I used to work for Ultor. How? I didn't think Dane had girls like you on retainer. I worked at the Pyramid as a microbiologist, you judgmental prick. A what? Read a book. And try it again. Get drunk, eat. You are leaving alive. You're not gonna give me a real fight. That was incredible.
Terra. Calling to apologize? What the hell did you do to these people? I guess you found the first one, huh? What was left of them? Altar's been experimenting with nanites. The hope was to find a way to increase a miner's lung capacity when I saw what they were doing to volunteers. I understand. When you get them all, drop the bodies off at Channel 6. Once the media runs the story, the Altor Saints. is finished. You can't take on all of us!
let me join. Did you have any problems? Nothing I couldn't handle. Good. So now what? We wait for Jane Valderrama to pick up the story. You think she's gonna run it? Channel 6 didn't exactly go crazy over the zombie Lynn story. No one cares about an undead gang member, but everybody hates a big corporation. Is this the pyramid? Yeah. Altor's built a huge R&D facility underneath Mount Claflin. Let me guess, they aren't developing a better bread box. Honestly, they probably are. They're just, you know, developing guns and body armor too. Why is Altor gunning for us? It doesn't matter. Here's the plan. Pierce and Shandy, I want the two of you to hit the streets and take out as much Altor property as you can. If Altor wants to come after us, fine. But we're gonna make it fucking cost them. Gat, you and I are gonna hit the pyramid. What, we don't get to blow shit up in public? Fine. We can do some damage street side, but we've got to be quick. I don't want to give Ultor any more of a heads up than we have to. You don't slow down for nothing, do you? Nice. 
All that blood can't be good for the paint job.
the destruction you've caused were worth it. I haven't seen anyone. After graduation, I'm getting drunk every night. No way! When I was, you're gonna let Bogle walk away, right? He's like my hero. Keep it advice, man. You ever find yourself in a bar drinking anything blue? Show me what you got! You uh, miss me? Drive. Yeah! Dane, while your project has been yielding positive results, the board is a little concerned. I don't understand. The Saints are out of control! That was the point. When you budgeted funds for Force Majeure, we didn't realize compromising the Pyramid was what you had in mind. We're dealing with violent criminals. Are you really surprised they might do something, I don't know, violent? The pyramid was not going to last forever. It's better to spin this now when we are the victims than when Channel 6 does an undercover expose. Dane, fix the problem. Okay, maybe I'm being too obtuse. Let me try this again. There is no problem. We've had enough of your ego. My ego is what got you this far. Finish off the saints, or being fired is the least of your worries. Is that all? Take care of this, Dane. Of course I will. I told you. This doesn't make any sense. You handed them a huge story. Ultor handed them money. Couldn't you force Valderrama to do something? I'll see what I can do, but we're gonna need some proof beyond a couple bodies. You came to me with this whole thing. You got any other ideas? If they want proof, our best bet is to get our hands on the chemicals while Ultor is moving them. All right, let's go.
There's the chemical truck. All right, let's take it. Is it first time? don't have a chance. We're gonna expose these ass- Fuck yeah! <laughs> Alright, get in the back and cover us. Ultor isn't gonna like losing a shipment. Let's stash this thing at the airport until we get a hold of Jane. They sent the scout prototype? <laughs> wow. Scout prototype? What the hell are you talking about? It's Eric Griffin's pet project. He wanted an ATV to scout for prime mining locations. Why does a mining vehicle need a goddamn turret? Hey, you gotta blast through rock. Makes sense to me. Where the hell are you people planning on mining? Trust me, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. We're almost there. Just buy us a little more time. There yet? We gotta keep these guys off us. We gotta hurry. I 
only I could hold these guys off! Jane, come on, it's a great story. I want an interview. What? Corporate greed stories are a dime a dozen. I want something more. A whistleblower endangering their lives for justice. That's how you get ratings. I don't know if she'll go for it. Then I'm not running your story. Fine, I'll go talk to her. I don't like this. It's just an interview. It's live TV. Anything can happen. I got shot at getting this shit for you, and now you're telling me you're nervous about being interviewed? It's stressful. No, people trying to kill you is stressful. Listen, smartass. You have no idea how hard it is to be in front of the camera. Did you see me on Fuzz? Yeah, but you didn't care if you did a bad job. All you had to do was kill a ninja with a chainsaw. True. Look, let's just get this over with, okay? How are you doing? I'm relaxing. You really that afraid of looking like a fool on national television? <sighs> You're not helping. You'll be fine. Can't you just imagine people in their underwear? Uh-uh. That won't work. I've got a thing with nudity. Then I guess you're fucked. <sighs> Again? Not helping. We can hold out here. Had the Saints stash some supplies in case shit went bad. How about a tour of the Saints hideout, baby? Wait here, Tara. I'm gonna check to make sure no one's coming. What the? Stay close to me, Terra. Looks like Ultor wants to shut you up bad.
Hold up. Jane's calling. My crew is already waiting for you. Find their truck, and I'll meet you there. Listen, I'm running behind. Just wait for me on the slopes below Mount Claflin. I'll be there soon. Aight, we'll be here. This is Jane Valderrama, reporting live with Terra, a woman who claims our city is in danger. That's right, Jane. The Ultor Corporation has been using a secret R&D lab to conduct unethical experiments on the citizens of Stillwater. Those are some strong allegations. I'm assuming you have proof. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I have the bodies of people who were experimented on, as well as some of the chemicals that were used to do it. And why do you think Ultor is responsible? I conducted the experiments myself. So these were the acts of a crazed individual? Excuse me? You said that you conducted the experiments. Well, yeah, but... So you admit that you perverted science to serve your own twisted desires. No! Ultor was the one that was... It's an all-too-familiar tale. A beautiful woman takes a job at a multi-billion dollar global corporation hoping to fulfill her dreams of microbiology, only to find herself disgusted at her failure to ascend the corporate ladder and turns to mad science in order to blackmail her employer. I'm Jane Valderrama, Channel 6 News. Why did you do that? I thought you were going to help us. Journalistic integrity doesn't pay the rent, Terra. You just humiliated me in public. I just made the saints a lot of money. Listen, honey, Altor was going to bury this story anyway. At least this way we got a little something out of it. Altor isn't going away. You'll have plenty of time to plot your little revenge scheme. Don't worry, I will. Culero. He's not the only breadwinner anymore. Big money! Big money! Big money! What's up, Dex? I know you're a cop. What the fuck are you talking about? Come on, man. Who you think you're talking to? The tactics? The police station thing? Your shitty haircut? You got cop written all over you. So, uh, what are you gonna do? Nothing. What? I'm out, Troy. I got offered a job at Ultor. I'm dropping my flags, and I'm going straight. I just want to make sure that we're not going to have a problem. How you doing, Julius? I was doing better before I got arrested. I wanted to talk to you about that. I bet you do. Listen, Julius, you've made some bad choices, but you're a good man. Let, let me help you out. What do you want? I want the Saints to be gone, okay? Now, there's two ways that that can happen. You can arrest all of us. Or you guys can quit while you're ahead. 
All right, this is my investigation. I can miss a few collars. What are you saying? Dex is out of the game, and you're in jail. If you can convince Johnny and your number two to drop their flags, the Saints will fall apart, and everyone goes home happy. You don't think this will work, do you? You think I like arresting my friends? Convince them to quit, and I won't have to. There's no way that player's gonna stop. Make them understand. Let's say I can. How do I know I'm going free? I've already talked to the mayor. Hughes is willing to give you guys pardons. I'll see what I can do. What the fuck was that? It was the only way. I said talk, not set off a goddamn bomb. Relax, Troy. The Saints are finished. Don't try to find me. I'm going to have to sell a kid now. The retail for me. Son of a stay out of the way. How you doing, player? If you've gone through Troy's files, you know that Julius set you up. Meet me at the old church, and I'll tell you where to find Julius. The fuck took you so long? You ain't Dex. Neither are you. You look different, did you? I didn't do shit to my hair. You pulling a gun on me? Well, I didn't have time to plant a bomb in the church, so this will have to do. You don't know what the hell you talking about. Why don't you educate me? I don't gotta explain shit to you. This is where we're gonna have to agree to disagree. Why don't you just put the gun down? We both know you're not gonna use it. Not yet. Stop! I never thought I'd see you beg, Julius. I'm not begging. I'm trying to talk some sense into you. I'm done listening to your bullshit. Put it together. Dex wanted us in the same place. Yeah, and why'd he want that? Can we kill each other later? Dex sent the Masako. Looks like he means business. Taking the shot. Get out of this shit. My sport is half the time.
steps, they can expect the same thing. Have an attack chopper. Who has those? Uh, I'm not giving. Uh. This ain't over yet. Let's get to my car. We did it! <coughs> I'll drive. Let's do it! I got some hardware you might like in the back seat.
bitches! Keeping us from getting shot? Just like old times, player. Yeah. Jesus. I thought we were past this. Not by a fucking long shot. Don't you get it? The Saints didn't solve a goddamn thing. Drugs were still being pushed. Innocent people were still getting killed. All we did was turn into vice kings that wore purple. Jesus Christ, you sound like a pussy. I sound like someone who's not a sociopath. You want to be the killer with a conscience? Fine. Drop your flags and write a book like King. But you never should have came after me. You telling me, if I would have asked you to walk away, you would have said yes. Fuck no. This is my city. Jesus. You haven't learned a goddamn thing. Wrong. I've learned that being in charge is better than being a bitch who keeps his mouth shut and does what he's told. Your time's over, old man. What's happened to you? I woke up. You owe me, player. If it wasn't for me, you would have died on that street corner. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't have been in a goddamn coma. But I guess that makes us even... Not really. I wanted to talk to the leader of the Saints. I wanted some freckle bitches and a blowjob. But I've learned to deal with disappointment. What you need from the Saints? I need protection. That's probably one of those things you should have thought of before you tried to have the boss killed in a church. I had nothing to do with that. You really need to separate the man from the company. I'm just saying. Attempted murder doesn't breed trust. We're on the same side. I ain't gonna lie. I think that's pretty fucking unlikely. Look, Dex's people are on their way. If I don't get out of here soon, the Masako are gonna kill me. Dex? Any part of the Oltar family? Families fight. Yeah, but they don't try to kill each other. Tell that to Julius. You got something on decks or not? You get me through this alive and you'll find out.
away from me. Just keep driving and we won't have a problem. Quit your bitching, you're still alive, ain't you? These bitches are just gonna stand there. It's their own funeral. I thought you did this for a living. Yes, I'm gonna need a new driver. That's not good. This ain't how I pictured my day going.
How was your weekend, Derek? Busy. Yours? Disappointing. Get used to it. I'm surprised you didn't call in sick. Well, I figure you can't kill me at the office. I'm head of security. I can do whatever I want. You're out of your league, Dex. No. You're just out of touch. Maybe. See you at the exec meeting. Wait, wait. Explain this one more time. I thought I made myself quite clear. No, you did. I just want to make sure it still sounds crazy the second time around. I thought you wanted to hurt Dex. My mistake. Yeah, hurt Dex, not fight a goddamn army. You'll have help. From who? A bunch of ultra renocops? They're not gonna shoot their own. That's what you're not getting. They're not our own. Dex has been moving waste from the nuke plant that he can sell in the black market, and now he's planning on using the Masako to destroy the evidence. If Ultor finds out what he's doing, Dex is finished. Please, Ultor wouldn't care. I've heard stories about what happens in the Pyramid. There's a difference between science and war profiteering. If we were into nuclear weapons, we'd be selling to countries with a real economy. Not some nut job that lives in a compound. That's encouraging. Dex wants to make his move tonight. Together we can stop him. I'm in. to thin out the Masako ranks before stopping Dex's shipment. How the fuck we supposed to do that? I leave the details up to you. Me against the whole army? You won't be alone. The security team at the plant is full of my people. Well, that'll be great for about 10 seconds. I'm having a little too much fun. Griffin's not who you think he is. He ain't you, and that's good enough for me. Got you outnumbered. Doesn't seem to be helping. Julius was right. You never know when to quit. It's one of my many charms. You can't beat me. Talk to me after I fuck up a few hundred more of you guys.
Impressive. Now get the remaining trucks down to the dock. My people will take care of it from there. You weren't gonna be needing this radioactive waste, were you? Do you have any idea what you are doing? Because I could just drop it off at your office if you did. This isn't some fucking backwoods gang from Stillwater that you're messing with! Maybe leave a bouquet of flowers to go with it? You listening to me! See you soon. Is everything in order, Katie? Yes, sir. Your effects are en route. And my office? I follow protocol. Your machine's been wiped and paper files have been shredded. Are you sure you can't wait a few days? You're going to miss the company picnic. I can, I'm sorry. This transfer is a big opportunity for me. I need to leave tonight. With respect, sir, you had me call in every favor you had to get an immediate transfer. It doesn't look like this is a step up for you. And what does it look like? Honestly, like you're running. You're a smart girl. The fuck you mean, he's gone? Dex left town last night. He requested an emergency transfer. This is bullshit, Griffin. There was nothing I could do. I swear to God, if I find out you helped him... I didn't. Then make it right. How? He knows you're trying to kill him. There's no way he's coming back. Fine. I can't get Dex. You're gonna help me get his people. His people? His friends. His soldiers. His fucking favorite street magician. If it's someone Dex cared about, I want him dead. I think I have an idea. All right, I'm in the lighthouse. How's the view? Adequate. Dex's people are all over. I'll identify as many as I can so you can work your... magic from that building. Wouldn't it be easier to just walk up to these assholes? If you want to go on a suicide run, be my guest. But if they spot you, we're both dead. If you say so. Someone's personal shopper is in for a surprise. I'd like to see that prick do the invisible box routine after this. Didn't have a chance! I don't suppose Dex's chauffeur would interest you. Someone who needs a harsh lesson in the realities of life. Well, they didn't even say goodbye. That is most certainly. 
certainly Dex the stylist. Someone should have worn a helmet. Done something wrong in their miserable life. You know what needs to be done with that one. Clearly, that person doesn't understand how dangerous those contraptions can be. My eyes closed half the time. Over there, one of Dex's accountants. Executive Pirate Bay run is about to begin. Here's your chance to knock a few rungs off the corporate ladder.
Let's take and expect the same thing. Over there, one of Dex's accountants. That motorcycle, take them out! Tax forces that fool to peddle month-old hot dogs in our cafeteria. Please put an end to the problem. insists on wearing that outfit to the office. I never want to see it again. You think they're gonna come down on you for this? Maybe. It isn't your problem anymore, right? Yeah, I don't give a shit. I was just being polite. Yeah, thanks for faking it. Anytime. So what are you gonna do now? I'm gonna find out which city Dex ran to and get the bitch. The Stillwater branch won't have any more unpleasantness with the Saints, will we? Hey, as long as you don't come after me and mine, you can go to Mars for all I care. What's this? Don't know. I found it here and it was addressed to you. Looking to crash your party? Thinking about it. Well, your history with boats is pretty solid, so, uh, this seems like a good idea. I think I'm gonna go find Shandy. Good idea. Don't you care who sent it? Nope. But it's probably a trap. Yep.
Stay out of my path. Oh, that's all right, Jamie. I think I'm going to skip it this year. Oh, and Jamie? Yes, sir? Please move my things to my new office and set up a press conference. You were promoted, Mr. Vogel? I'm about to be. Got a tip that a bunch of Altor execs are meeting up at the Round Square Shopping Center today. They're being escorted around by Altor security, but taking them out shouldn't be too hard. Now let's remind these fuckers who they're dealing with. Why, when will he be so 
Before, just wait. Serve itself to fit.
Jogo should have been honored. Only the purest of them. Ah! Oh. Please be the apocalypse. Things never change. Think we can pay off the witnesses? I can't be seen here. Drive! Go! Go! Ah! You wanna get those take them out! You in position, Johnny? Oh, yeah. Just make sure I get to focal. Could you elaborate on your affiliation with local gang? As most of you know, the Old Tour board of directors were assassinated the other night, and while we at Old Tour would like to take the time to mourn their passing, sadly, that's a luxury we don't have. The corporate office has named me chairman. And I wanted to personally let you all know, not only will business continue as usual, but we will be taking even greater strides forward. Monica Hughes has graciously greenlit a project that's very dear to us at Old Tour, the revitalization of Shivington. In the coming days... He's got a gun! He's got a gun! Oh, oh, <laughs> Mr. Volk, come with us.
better get the police down here. That asshole Vogel yet? The bitch is hiding in the Phillips building. The whole thing's in lockdown. The security station's all over the outside of that thing. You take a helicopter, blow those things up, you'll crash the security. They'll all go down.
right, let's not be too hasty here. You're upset, you're frustrated, and you've got a gun, which you know I'd really like it if you would put that away. You should have thought of that before you sent a team to wipe out my gang. I tried telling the board that going after the Saints was a big mistake. They should have listened to you. Believe me, right now I am agreeing with you 100%, but you have to look at the positives. You're alive, they're dead, and you have the Saints' number one fan running all- <laughs> We missed it? Told ya. Now pay up. Where the fuck were you guys? Traffic. What? He's not joking. The roads have been blocked off. You see Get out there? Oh, he's fine. He's still out there killing cops. Figures. What is it? It's done. Time to pull out of there. You sure? Get the fuck off of me! I mean, I'm not running out of ammo anytime soon. I'm sure. See you back home. Later. Who you calling now? Our ride. our city. We do whatever the fuck we want to do. 